Albert Einstein once said, everything in life is vibration. What does it mean to say that everything is vibration? At the most basic level, everything in the universe, every atom, every cell, every star, and even our thoughts and feelings are in a state of motion. This motion generates energy or vibration. When matter vibrates, it produces energy, and this energy manifests as the physical world we see, touch, and experience. Even the things that seem solid are vibrating, although at a frequency that we can't perceive. Your thoughts, your emotions, your attitudes, they all carry specific vibrations that influence the course of your life. If you generate positive thoughts and emotions, you create positive vibrations that attract good things into your life. The law of attraction, which you may have heard of, operates on this very principle. It says that like attracts like. High vibrations attract positive outcomes, and low vibrations attract negative ones. So how can you raise your vibration? Here are seven ways to raise your emotional and spiritual vibrations. Gratitude. You've probably heard the saying, where focus goes, energy flows, and it couldn't be truer when it comes to gratitude. The act of focusing on what you're grateful for not only pulls you out of negative emotions, but also shifts your entire energetic state to a higher frequency. This isn't just a flowery spiritual concept, it's backed by science, with studies showing that practicing gratitude can have tangible health benefits, such as reducing stress and improving mental well-being. First of all, gratitude acts as an immediate energy shifter. Imagine you're having a bad day, everything seems to be going wrong. The moment you shift your focus to something you're thankful for, your emotional state begins to change. Your attention moves away from what's lacking or stressful to what is abundant and soothing. The simple act of acknowledging the good, even if it's just the blue sky or a cup of coffee, has the power to shift your mood and elevate your vibrational frequency instantly. When you focus on gratitude, you're essentially sending out positive vibrations. According to the law of attraction, those high vibration feelings attract more things to be grateful for. So you end up creating a positive loop of energy. You're grateful, so you attract good things. Good things happen, so you feel more gratitude. It's a beautiful cycle that fuels itself. And gratitude builds emotional resilience. When life throws challenges your way, a grateful mindset helps you keep perspective. It's not about denying difficulties, but about framing them. Every obstacle becomes a lesson you're thankful for, making you more resilient and better equipped to face future challenges. Gratitude is more than just saying thank you. It's a transformative force that elevates your vibration, deepens your spiritual connection, and spreads positivity like wildfire. Love. Love operates on an immensely powerful frequency and holds the capability to transform your life. Imagine someone you deeply love for a moment. It can flood your system with a variety of feel-good chemicals like dopamine, oxytocin and endorphins. Not just that, you begin to vibrate at a higher frequency. It's an immediate shift from scarcity to abundance, from lack to completeness. Love is a full state of being. There's no room for negativity, worry or fear when you're filled with love. What makes love particularly potent is that it heals. Whether it's a bad day, a broken heart, or a lifelong struggle, love has the unparalleled power to heal. It brings back color to a gray world, adds flavor to life when things seem bland. Have you ever noticed how the mere presence of a loved one can make pain more bearable? Or how a simple, heartfelt hug can wash away hours of stress? That's the elixir of love working its magic. Love is not limiting, it is expansive. When you love, your heart grows to make room for more. And the beautiful part, the more you love, the more love you attract. Like a magnet, your loving energy draws people, opportunities, and even more reasons to love towards you. The effect is exponential. It's as though the universe itself leans in to listen to the heart that beats with genuine love. Love is also the catalyst for your soul's growth. Through love, 
you step into your true essence. Every act rooted in love elevates your spiritual awareness and brings you closer to your higher self. Love adds layers to your being and depth to your soul. What's truly awe-inspiring is how love connects you to the fabric of the universe. Love transcends the physical plane. It's a universal language that the soul understands. When you love, you actively participate in the universe's grand creation. Your high vibrational energy intertwines with the cosmic energy, creating a harmony that is ineffable. It's important to note that love also involves setting healthy boundaries. Loving yourself means knowing when to say no, understanding your worth, and not settling for less than you deserve. This is also a form of high vibrational energy, for when you set boundaries, you make room for healthier, more aligned forms of love to enter your life. Don't limit love to a feeling, make it a lifestyle. Every decision you make, every interaction you have, let it be guided by love. You don't even have to make grand gestures. Even small, everyday acts of kindness are powerful expressions of love. Generosity. When you give freely, without expecting anything in return, you engage in a divine act that elevates your vibration to unparalleled heights. The first thing to understand about generosity is that it's an unlocker of abundance. When you give, you are operating from a mindset of abundance, not scarcity. You're saying, I have enough to share. This shifts your focus from what you lack to what you have, and in doing so, you're attracting more abundance into your life. You might think you're depleting your resources by giving, but in actuality, you're setting the stage for them to multiply. Every act of generosity is an energetic exchange between the giver and the receiver. The person receiving feels seen, loved and taken care of, while you, the giver, experience an immediate surge in your vibrational energy. Why? Because acts of generosity align you with your highest self, which naturally exists in a state of compassion, love, and abundance. Just like love and gratitude, generosity also has the power to heal. If you're feeling low, disconnected, or restless, try giving. As you mentioned, if you're feeling poor, give a little to charity. If you're feeling lonely, uplift someone else's day. You'll find that as you give, a sense of purpose fills you. Your issues may not vanish, but their grip on you weakens, replaced by a newfound sense of joy and fulfillment. The beautiful thing about generosity is its universality. You don't need to be rich or powerful to give. You can give your time, your love, your knowledge, or even a simple smile. The universe doesn't discriminate between big or small acts of generosity. The vibrational shift occurs regardless of the scale. Generosity also expands your sense of self. In giving, you break down the ego's barriers that scream, me, 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 and allow yourself to connect with others at a soul level. This not only enhances your own spiritual journey, but also creates a collective rise in vibrational frequency. Your generosity acts like a spark that can ignite a fire of giving in others, leading to a collective elevation of energy. It's also important to approach generosity with groundedness. Giving shouldn't be a chore or an act of self-deprivation. Balanced generosity includes knowing when to give and when to hold back for your well-being. In being generous, don't forget to be generous to yourself. True generosity comes from a cup that's overflowing.